On Wednesday, September 13th, the first phase of the Palmist Roofing Project commenced. This initiative, spearheaded by the Member of Parliament for Sufra, promises multiple benefits to the community, ranging from employment opportunities for local youth to improved housing conditions for residents. The contractor on the project, Darrell Thomas, says this initiative was overdue and has brought renewed hope to the community of Palmist. So basically what we're doing is changing the, the old organizing roof or the, or, the, or the structures in Palmist. Um, we have three subcontractors. Um, we started today, today, Wednesday. So we probably probably last like two weeks max. Finish probably 82 houses. Changing, galvanize some bad posts, two by fours, whatever the, the people wants to be changed on the houses. Um, yeah, that's basically it. So all right, right now there we have we have four groups, basically each group have like six workers employed. So at least we have something good going on in the community. At least we have the guys engaged, the young fellas in the community engaged, have something doing instead of sitting and staying idle. Um, I think it's a good initiative for the district. Um, I, I can say like the people of Palmas needed that. So basically now uh, you can see when it's raining, Palmas people don't have to put their heads outside or <laughs> put blocks on the roofs or anything. So I guess it's a it's a good initiative moving forward. Um, I'm going to thank the the Labour Party and the district rep. As the roofs and posts of these houses are replaced, the project is expected to not only provide much needed jobs but also contribute to the overall beautification and modernization of the community. Member of Parliament for Soufre Fosse Jacques, Emma Hippolyte, expressed her commitment to improving the lives of all her constituents. It's the rainy season, persons are coming to my constituency saying they need assistance to repair this, that and the other. I felt I just needed to do it as a whole. And as well, after the heavy storm, Brett, the block that is covered with asbestos, what I would call the black stone block, uh, maybe one or two units that got damaged. So again, that really caused us to act urgently. And maybe within the next two weeks, what we're going to do is to focus on phase two of the project, which is the removal, the safe removal of all asbestos, not only those that are damaged, all asbestos in the Blackstone block and replace them with completely new things. The project has been met with enthusiasm from the local population. The project is also expected to raise the standard of living for Palmist residents, ensuring safer and more comfortable housing. One resident, Joseph Valence Abel, expressed immense gratitude for the project. We try and we best to put that in good condition because the way it was, the process, it wasn't good at all, at all, at all. Now we have the priority to make it right. So we try and we best to make it the right way. And we thank the minister, we thank she a lot for she to get this work be going today. Which means everybody appreciate it, young and old. The young one appreciate it as well, they're getting their day's work to be done. The old one, they have a proper shelter now, they can't get wet. Which best we want? We don't want nothing else again. We're good to go. As work on the roofing project continues, residents say they are excited to see what other initiatives are in the pipeline. From Soufra FM, I am Genevieve Gonzag.